All right, what's going on, y'all? Welcome back to the Double Down Room. We got another system review here. We got a new system requested by Mr. Rob Knowles. So appreciate you, Rob, for the request. We got the Stern Betting Strategy here, or Stern Betting System. If you're not familiar with how this system works, I'm going to put the rules right here real quick so we can uh, take a look at it and see how it works. But basically, you have nine levels, and every time you lose, you're going to move up to the next level. And once you get past that first one, you have to win two in a row in order to start over. So the first three levels, you're, ta you're doing the table minimum. So we're going to do $10 here on this one just to keep uh, an a easy track. Uh, if you lose your first three bets, you're going to go on to level four, which is going to be double your original bet, so $20. Four and five are going to be the same, so 20, 20. You lose those two, you go to 40, and then 40. And then you lose those two, you go to 80 and 80. Now, if you win any bet on your way up to level nine, once you win once, you're going to press that bet. So you're going to take what you won, stack it on top, and then uh, you have to win two in a row to start over. So if you lose that second bet, you're just going to continue up to level nine, and we'll see how it goes. So if you guys have any of your own systems or other systems that you want to see played in this fashion, make sure you leave it in the comments down below, and we'll get that out for y'all. Uh, we're going to do this maybe once or twice. Like I said, we're going to do this against Flatbed just to get a regular basis on how the system goes. And I'm also going to add a unit tracker to this one so we can we can keep track of how many units were up or down. I know there's people out there that will play until they reach a unit limit, not so much a uh, dollar amount, or just playing till the shoe's over or playing for whatever the case may be. So if you're only in the casino trying to win 10 units, you can find out as soon as you hit 10 units, you're done. So we'll keep that out here and then make sure you guys like the video, subscribe to the channel. We got a lot more content coming out, set, ready to go. And like I said, any system you want to see out here, we got two-way battles right now like this head-to-head. -head. We got four-way systems, battles, and uh, ASMR. Lot. So here we go. 14.03, we'll stay there. 16. All right, so now that we lost this first one, we have to win two in a row in order to start over back at level one. So blackjack's a good blackjack. We'll take that. So we're just going to press up regular like as if we didn't win a blackjack. So we'll stay there. Got 18 on 8. 17, that's a win. So we won two in a row, so we get to start over back at our regular $10 unit. Reset this real quick. Right, we got 21, perfect, 14, 20. That's enough for a dub. Go. Another blackjack, that's what I'm talking about. Perfect, perfect. So, so far so good. We're not really testing the system out. We only t barely tested it. We'll see if we can get deeper into this. 14 on an 8, going to hit it, 16, 17, 11, 14, too many, here we go, so basically just like flat bet, oh man, almost a blackjack, alright, take insurance, never take insurance, alright, no blackjack, we got 18, 12, 15. Oof, set, that's 20. All right, here we go. 11 on the ace. We're not going to double 11 on the ace. That's the only one you don't double 11s on. 12, 22. All right, here we go. On to level three. So we're still betting the table minimum. I'll double this up. The one good thing about this one with the first three being the same is uh, you don't run up your bets that fast. The only thing that sucks is if you're on like level six and you have to double down. 
you know. So here we go. 13 on 4, we're going to stay there. 14, 15, 18. So we're moving on up. Moving on up. Got 12 on a 10. Go hit it. 22. All right. Here we go. $40 bet. Got 9 on the 10. Go hit it. Four, 15. 14, I mean. Too many. All right. Now we're really testing it. We'll see what happens. Gonna hit this 12, 19, 6, 16, too many. Perfect. So we won one, so we're gonna press this and hope that we can win this one. If we lose this one, we're just gonna go to the next level. There we go. It's got $80 out there. Oh! Beautiful. So we got $80, so we're gonna get 120 back. 120 for that, 3 to 2. There we go. Set this up. Yeah, this system's kind of... It's easy, but hard to keep track of. Easy to keep track of, but hard to keep track of, kind of. I got to set all this up so I don't get lost. You know? Here we go, here we go. Got 12 on a 3, we're going to hit it. 16, 13, too many. Alright, 11, we're going, this is it. Perfect golden opportunity right here. Double down. Mm, can't even pick up this card. 15. What the? Alright, we'll take that push. Seventeen on three. We'll stay there. Six. Eleven. Twenty-one. Perfect. <laughs> Perfect. Next level. Level two. Got 12 right here on a 10. 22. Yeah. All right, level three. We're still on our still on our base, so we're giving ourselves a chance here. You know what I'm saying? Too many. All right, here we go up. Next level. Gonna hit this. Too many. Going to the next level. So, we're definitely going to do this against the D'Allen Barrett because that's my favorite system. And uh, they're both a negative progressive system. So, that should be a really good, interesting video. We'll see which which one, you know, which system I like best after that. That might be the next one that I play at the casino. Alrighty. There we go, baby. Perfect. Start all this all over again. All right, here we go. Here we go. Eleven on ten. That's a double. A lot of double downs on this one. Probably because we're playing at the double down room. Mm. All right. We just continue the system. So the good thing is you only need two wins for this. Like when you get two wins, you can start over and you're not risking as much. But, you know, you hit those losing streaks 
and then you try to win two in a row after hitting those big win or losing streaks. It gets kind of scary. Well, here we go. Round three. Blackjack. Mm hmm. So we're going to stack that. Going for two. Looking good. Four. Fourteen. Oh, uh, what? So because we lost that one, we're just going to continue like we didn't win at all. We got to win two in a row before we can start over. So one win doesn't really count towards anything. Which is nice, but not nice. Mm, we're just going to keep moving. Fourteen. Too many. See, losing is very easy to do in blackjack. Winning, not so much. Uh, and then to win two in a row. I mean, two in a row doesn't sound like that much. You got these other systems that are trying to win four in a row, or you have to win three in a row in order to profit or whatever. This one, you only need two. That's the one thing with the Allen Bear too. Like once you hit a losing streak. Then you need a winning streak to come back down or you're just stuck with the high bets forever. So you see how hard it is to win two in a row. And then you get a push right there. Alright, we got 10. We're going to uh, just hit this. 16. Ooh, okay. Take that win and go home. <laughs> So, you know what I'm saying? If you're that type of person that's only like, I'm playing until 10 when it's at 10 units and I'm out, you're basically out at this point, which is okay with me, you know? Right? We're up 15.5 units. I'm, t I'm going home. I'm not even going to look back. But sometimes I like to go and I'll just play one shoe. So, I'll go to the casino and be like, I'm going to play one six deck shoe. And once that shoe's over, I'm going home. Once that shoe's over, I'm going home. So, what type of player are you? Do you like to play shoes, or do you do you like to play to a certain unit, or what? <clears throat> all righty, set it all back up. Here we go. Got six. Definitely hitting that. Fifteen. Thirteen. Ooh, what? There's some. Uh, there's a lot of random twenty ones. Like, all right. So we have to stack this one, even though it's the first level. Trying to make a profit. Thirteen on ace, no insurance, but we got the blackjack suited. Here we go, round three, level three. We're still up a good chunk. Look at the flatbed. Flatbed, if you have a losing a losing record, you're losing probably, most likely. So flatbed's nice because it doesn't really, it's not that risky. You're not risking a lot of money. You're just betting the same, but you can't capitalize on win streaks or losing streaks and for this matter with this system. Like, we have a losing streak and we're up a lot. There we go. Five. Fifteen. Oh my. You see what I'm saying? That's like the third different variation of 21 that we've got in this game. Alright, ten. On a five, we're going to double it down. Got 11. Four. There we go. We'll take that win. Measly little 13. Okay, so we're going to just stack this. I think uh, if you want to double down, I probably wouldn't continue. I'd probably start the streak over the system, but I'm not sure if uh, you still win the same amount. Actually, I think you do. Yeah. 
He might be down one. But... All right, here we go. Take that dub. Keep it moving. Flat bit out here, staying flat basically. 18 on the 10. Oh shoot! And that's another suited. So this game is crazy. We've had suited, multiple suited blackjacks, blackjacks with all kinds of combinations. Oh, what the? Yeah, this is ugly. Twenty, twelve. What is this? Fifteen. What? <laughs> Yo, this can't be right. It's crazy that we're still up on the stern system too. With all this nonsense going on, this better not be a black jacket. I swear. <laughs> Yo, I swear this ain't rigged. All right, this is not rigged. That's crazy. We got eight, sixteen, no ten. Oh, okay, at least not a blackjack. If that would have been another ace, hey, all right. So that's it. Let's see what we got to bring it in. So there's four hundred, hundred and that's twenty five, forty. So four hundred and forty with the flat bet. So we're down six units. So, if you were to play this with, you know, $25 units, um, you want to take away 6 units. So, basically, 25 times 6, that's how much you would be down if you played with $25 units. So, that's why we added the unit tracker. So, whatever your units are, if you play $15 tables, or you play $50 a unit, or $100 a unit, this is how many units you'd be down. You just take your unit measure, and you multiply it by this number right here, units, and you'll get your number so stern system there's our buy-in right here 500 so we're definitely up Let's see how much we're up by so uh, 125 so 125 dollar profit on the stern with that horrible shoe so that was pretty impressive but no match for the flat so we'll do it again soon um, we're going to definitely do it against the d'alembert because that's going to be a good test on the two modified martingale versions um negative progression so like i said leave a comment down below let me know what you guys thought about that any suggestions on the next system battle system review let me know in the comments and i'll see y'all then peace